Hi right, folks, Ryan Cowboy and here I'm back checking with you and uh, you did the download, right? You clicked on the button on the last page and you took that fitness knowledge assessment. What'd you learn? Were you honest with yourself? Did you honestly say, if you didn't know the answer 100%, you said, no, no, I don't know the answer. But, but I'm here, that's why I'm here, I'm gonna seek the answer. Look, ignorance is bliss. Don't try big shot in it, don't try say, oh yeah, I know it. You know what, if, you don't, if you're not applying something, you really don't know it. So, make sure if you didn't do the personal knowledge fitness assessment on yesterday's assignment, that you go do it, because along this journey, you're gonna learn it. See, me as the, as the fitness coach, I don't know what's broke till I do some testing and I find out. So I don't know how to fix you and I don't know what to change and what to advise to change and you don't know either till you specifically know. Uh, and what you're realizing right now is getting your fitness knowledge from fitness magazines isn't gonna do it. So uh, next question, your goals. Did you, did you dive a little deeper and find out what your goals are and get specific and lay out a timeline for the next uh, month, next three months, next six months? Write it down, you gotta get specific. If you just say, you know Ryan, I just wanna lose weight and that's it, your mind is, that's not emotional enough. Uh, we gotta get this dude right here, it's gotta get emotional enough. So uh, with that being said, if, if you didn't do it, why didn't you do it? Are you too busy? You don't have time? This is your life, folks. Go do it. The biggest excuse people give me on, on foods and on working out and, and uh, whatever is I don't have time. Well, let me ask you, if you don't have time, what time do you get up each day? If you're saying, all right, and I get up at six o'clock, well, you know what? Get up at 5.30, there's an extra half hour. What time do you go to bed? You go to bed at 11.30, go to bed at 12. Half hour early, half hour late, there's an extra hour a day. I'm telling you, on this journey, the fitter we get, the healthier we get, the more we get this fit, the less sleep that you're gonna need. If right now you wake up each morning just, ugh, lethargic, oh my God, open my mouth and dump about a gallon of coffee down me and then a few energy drinks and then some sodas all day long. Maybe that's where your body is right now, but the road ahead, once we start detoxing you, um, you're gonna get a lot more energy, you're gonna find a lot more time. So, and I'm not just telling you this because I don't do it. You know, I got two little toddlers at home. I, I get up at uh, sometimes four in the morning and I'll go till two at night. A lot of times I go on three hours of sleep and I work out myself and I train here and I, you know, it's, uh, I, I don't make excuses. I make time to make sure I have the excuses to be able to get the stuff done. So I know you can do it. I, I so believe in you. Reach deep inside and just say, you know what? Let's start out simple. Let's set the alarm clock for an extra 15 minutes early and let's go to bed 15 minutes late. There's an extra half hour right there, folks. So if you really want it, you'll get it. You'll make the time. But it all comes down to those goals that you wrote down. If you just wrote down you want to lose weight and that's it, <laughs> there is, you can't get emotional about that. There is no way you'll take my challenge and get up at 15 minutes or a half hour early and stay up a half hour. You're like, are you kidding me? I need that kind of sleep. So the next thing I'm going to teach you today, right here, right now, this time, I'm going to teach you how to instantly change your mindset, energize your mind, get your lymph system going, and get your metabolism going, okay? This is so simple, but I didn't make it up. I can't take credit for it. I'm just passing along and I'm teaching it to you. This is incredible, okay? I call it the 4-4 power move, okay? Basically what you're doing is you're gonna breathe in the nose for four, so four power breaths in and four power breaths out. Try it with me, ready? You're gonna do that when you first wake up in the morning. In fact, when you're still laying in bed, you do that for a minute straight, it's gonna start powering your mind up. Just like when you turn the computer on, it starts booting up, start powering your mind up. It's powering your psychology up, powering this thing up, powering your 
metabolism up, get your lymph system going. The lymph system is what gets rid of the waste out of your body. So you're gonna do that and you know what? You can do it unlimited times throughout the day. I do it in the morning in bed to, to really wake me up when I'm in the shower. You know, when I'm, I'm, I'm driving to work. Every moment that I need some energy here, then if you really wanna take it to the next level, put a little bounce into it. Okay, so that's your homework assignment. This is what I want you to do between now and tomorrow when I come back is the 4-4 power move, the and do it, okay? If you don't wanna do it, you think it's silly, you know what? The life that I've created, people may think it's silly, but it's the dream life that I've always wanted, and it's these simple little tools. This will work, just try it for one day. If you don't feel any better, if you don't notice any difference, if you don't feel more energized, and if you, if anything doesn't make you laugh, then, then fine, drop it and go back to the old ways that, that you were doing because you were, I guess, maybe it was working for you. But give that a shot, just a, and this is what you're gonna do, okay? Anytime during the day you're low on energy, anytime during the day you have a negative thought, anytime during the day something happens to you that just uh, that de-energizes you or, or something don't go the way you want it and you're like, oh man, this sucks, or something that, that you didn't want to happen happens, something bad happens, power this up, just go. Okay, really quick, and then I'll let you go. If you've ever watched a sporting event and you watch really close, say a, say a guy getting ready to, to bat or a football player, or I know just from being a pro rodeo rider, if you ever notice, athletes right before they get ready to do something, they'll go, okay? It's that boost, it's that, it's that, it's that power, it, it's the expel of the oxygen out of their body, it, boom! It, scientifically proven, it gets the lymph system engaged, it gets the psychology engaged, and I'm telling you, they give you that wild look in your eye, and it'll work. So, go do that, that's the homework assignment. I'll check back with you tomorrow, folks. And uh, I'm excited to uh, hear your comments and your little posts to see how that worked for you. Signing off, Ryan Cowboyman. Woo, that's what I'm talking about.